But like, notoriously, Fox versus Pikachu, it's really hard for Fox because Fox is a fast follower and fast followers are combo food. True. And then uh, Pichu also has access. Pikachu also has access to the like the frame one thunder that he can able to calm down if he is getting hit. So well, let's find out how this is gonna go out. Yeah. Your ex Yoshi versus PG Esam. If I'm Esam, what I want to do is try to get X Yosher into disadvantage state as fast as possible so that he could like exploit that linear recovery. That's right. Now I want to see how Esam's able to exploit it. Oh, there's the up air, uh, up tilt to up air, and to air. Trying and to know, rack up as much damage as possible. So we were saying that earlier when we saw Esam play, he wasn't really utilizing his nair. But in this game, it looks... Looks like against Fox, he utilizes it a lot more. He's yeah. already used it four times. Yeah, it's it might be character, it might be matchup specific then, because maybe like Peach has more range, you know, as compared to Fox. Fox is more of an in-your-face character, and like Nair might be a more of a get-off people. Right, definitely the combo breaker. Oh, there's the that was a delayed Nair, and it actually caught Axios off like off uh, four. A then. great tech, and X Osher gonna be able to get back to stage and now punishing Esam with the ledge trap. Then a oh, down smash to X! That two frame was sick! Coming in from X Osher. Oh, but, but the back air connected for Esam, he's gonna be going in, and now it's his turn. Not gonna be able to get the tech that time. Yeah, actually falling straight down, but I think Lucas might have just fallen a little too far down. Yeah, he did get the tech, he just. Uh, the way he bounced, the way he tagged, and not having access to a second jump just didn't allow him to make it back. Oh, there's the Nair, but it traded, but he didn't fall down fast enough. And this is this is a, a Dragon Ball Z fight just off stage, hitting each other back and forth. I know, living life on the, <laughs> at the razor's edge. <laughs> Man, I love sky battles, actually, you know? <laughs> like, both players off stage just duking it out like true gentlemen. Okay, landing it up air, and Esam trying to get the juggle, but dragging down with Nair. And I like the pressure, the shield pressure with those down tilts. Mm -hmm. And actually, Esam hitting him with the Nair, but missing out. Again, there's the fair, that's the stock. That shine stall not working out for Axiosher. Esam just doesn't really care, he just went in. It's, it's kind of interesting that he went for a shine stall. I'm not sure what Axiosher was expecting from Esam. Yeah. Like, he was probably expecting, like, maybe uh, the immediate, like, side B and Esam to try to just go and try to catch up immediately. But there's the Thunder to take out the stock. Yeah, he even got the spike hitbox to take game one. Yeah, I'm, I'm really liking how Esam is just calling out X Yoshi's recoveries. And, like, he did it three times. That's kind of how he's been closing out all of his stocks. Like, if. Like that, and that's kind of what I was saying in the beginning. Like, where Esam needs to get him into disadvantage so he can just go in. Just hit him with that fair. Hit him with an air. Hit him with the back air. Hit him with something to, yeah. like, kill him. Hit him with everything. Yeah, hit him with everything. Dare, up air, something. Whoa, this ain't six. This isn't a. This isn't melee. We this isn't melee. <laughs> go on the other stream. <laughs> no, no up air spikes <laughs> to punish. Oh, the drag down there. Ooh. It looked like he was actually trying to set up for the thunder spike. Wow, oh, man, there's the loops. Here's the loop. You got some loops. Man, 60% off those, uh, off the up tilt to drag down there. Okay, but oh, but here's a, here's a little string of its own. Yeah, even getting the jab reset. Yeah. Exos are able to bring out with the percent. Oh, no, that's not where you want to be. Oh, no. The drag down forward air into down tilt. Oh, oh no. the thunder again, getting hit by that trap again. Yeah. Maybe he's trying to maybe he's trying to reflect it, you know. Maybe, maybe. that's the next level raid. Maybe. Maybe we're not giving X Yosha enough credit. Yeah. Up smash, both of them whipping, an up air connecting. Oh, and look at that, bringing out the shine very quickly, expecting the thunder. Yeah. Oh, couldn't get him. That multi hit not really working out for um, X Yosha. Nice tech, but this is not where you want to be. Yeah, a little bit too low. Just kind of put yourself in the perfect position to get down air spike. Not exactly his uh, choice. To to be. Oh no, here's the loop. Another one. Another no. one. <laughs> yeah, man, it seems like um, Esam has mainly been getting him like to like the 60-ish percentage, and then Exio just been falling out of it. 
Oh man, he just went for it all. Uh, that was kind of BM on ESAM's part. Very BM. <laughs> but now ESAM back on stage. Still oh, Wade. Yeah, still on his first stock, and now Osh Yosher on oh, his last. No, he taunted him. Man, that was actually the first time X Yosher rolled. <laughs> and he, he still called him out on it. Jeez. These loops are ridiculous. Yeah. The loop. Landing back. Oh, there's a jab block, but no, he couldn't get him with the forward smash. Yeah, smart stuff from X Yosher to use the invincibility for the wake up attack. Man, X Yosher, please take out a stock. Yeah, you gotta get one, Yosher. Oh, oh no. A dash attack. And a three stock from E Sam. Yo, that first game looked. Really good though. That first game was looking really nice for uh, Max Yosher, but 